Look at this tunnel, this thing is so dope. This is definitely th the sickest tunnel I've seen. What's going on guys? Welcome back to the Fish Friday. Today we are going to be sleeping under a tunnel of sharks. We are at Ripley's Aquarium of the Smokies. It's been a mission to get here, but we made it. We're going to take a look at the aquarium. It's actually closed right now. We're going to get a BTS tour. Super excited for this. And then we're going to be sleeping under a tunnel of sharks. If you guys are new here, hit the subscribe button, turn the notifications on. We got new fish videos every single Friday. Let's go. Hey, turn up double fists in it there, buddy. Cheers. Look at this massive tank right in the entrance when you walk into this aquarium. There are so many fish in here. Tropical rainforest, baby. Oh, are those piranhas? No. Yeah. They are? Yeah. This tank setup is super dope. <laughs> That's crazy. And what's even crazier is that look how calm. Oh my god, look at the mouth on that one. What's even crazier is that they're so calm like this, and then they just go piranha frenzy. Whoa! An eel, but where's he going? Hello? Hello, sir? Oh, there he is, there he is. That's not an eel. What's an eel? An electric eel. Look, look at his little flippers. Look how cute he is. Oh my goodness. Damn, eight feet. He's got. He's only like halfway grown. Look at his tail. How it goes like up. Oh, this guy's scared. Sorry guys, I'm not gonna hurt you. I want them to skip across. Look how they just stay. How do they stay outside the water like that? Yeah, but he's outside of the water. Yeah. yeah, exactly. Oh, <laughs> it's skin and special gills can absorb oxygen from the air So they're able to just breathe out of the water Freaking sick. This fish right here is called the four-eyed fish And it's like the uh, the GoPro lenses that you put that you can see out under the water and up, look at his little eyes coasting the dome. the dome. Yeah, the GoPro dome where you can see above water and underwater at the same time time to head to the ocean side, baby Schooling fish, those look fake. Big old appetitions. Oh no. Throw the tank away. Got some jellies over here. We know all about the jellies. This one don't look too hot. Oh yeah, that one's a goner. Sorry, bud. This is kind of like the size that mine were. Whoa, look at their mouths. <laughs> Hello. Hello. But look, look, they just they just go with their mouth open and just let the food look. <laughs> I feel like if I was a fish, this is probably the fish I would just be like, just let all the food just come to me. Look at this thing. They just start at one end, open their mouth, and just swim as fast as they can through to all the food. This one doesn't even have an eye. He's missing an eye. What the? Did you see that? He was missing an eye. I turned around. Huh? Huh? I need to find that one again. Whoa, he's not part of them. <laughs> what are you doing in here, buddy? That's a fish. A flounder. A flounder, yeah. But this is not what a flounder looks like when we catch it in the ocean. Why is it like this? How they are. How do they swim? This way. So then why do we catch it this way? That's how you pick them up out of the water. <laughs> <laughs> what the heck is this thing? What is this thing? Uh, a batfish. A batfish. There's some weird fish in here. These are pretty cool. They'll uh, blend into a rock or something. You'll never see them. Look at this big room. Oh, we got a shark. We got a shark, ladies and gentlemen. Just one, I think. Da -dum, da -dum, da -dum, da -dum. Ooh, two of them. Hello, guys. Black tips. My boy Quincy said he wants these. He looks fake. He's pretty. All right, guys, I think it is time to check out some of the filtration system on an aquarium like this. What does it take to run? What does it even look like? Maybe we'll see some quarantine fish. I don't know what else we'll see. Let's do it. Woo. So many systems. 
freaking science project over here. Plumbing galore. This is crazy. And the way this mechanical sand filters are going to work is the water from the exhibit is going to come in the top. And it's going to catch all the waste, solid food particles, things like that on top. So it kind of works like a strainer for pasta. Uh, it's going to catch all the big stuff and all the water is going to continue to go through. These guys can filter out 125 gallons per minute. Right now it's running at about 120. Which is really good. Once you get down to like 110, we're going to do what's called a backwash. So we're going to reverse the flow. So instead of coming in the top, it is then going to come in the bottom. And it's going to sift that sand kind of like flour. So all that stuff that's been compacted down on top is going to go up into the water column. And it's going to go through this brown appropriate colored pipe, which is our backwash drain. And it's going to go into two big, like literally poop basins below us for us to continue to filter out. Look how tall those are. Check out this dope fish they got in quarantine right now. If anybody knows what that is, drop a comment. That guy is sick. All right, where are we going now? Where are we going? Oh, we got the top. Top. Mermaid. That's a fat boy. I think an otter's on the way right now, maybe. What's she pulling out of there? It's, oh, that's not an otter. That's definitely not an otter. <laughs> Why is there an iguana next to the, the reef tank? That's an interesting mix. Oh. This thing is rough. Yeah. Oh yeah, much smoother down here, buddy. <laughs> so calm. And we're back. This is pretty cool huge walkway room oh that's a big shark oh look i think this is the tunnel we're gonna be sleeping in right here well that's yeah we're gonna we're gonna sleep in the tunnel what oh that's all the way around that's kind of good because i think there's like 30 people in this uh in like this thing so it's really nice that they don't have to sleep in the same mattress as us <laughs> this guy's huge his skin looks a little rough he does have a little fin Aw, maybe he's self-conscious about that. Don't tell him, tell him <laughs> that. What I see, though. Your fin is beautiful, buddy. You keep swimming. Yeah, you're you're beautiful. Woo! Look what I can do. This is not our side, I don't think. This is chill. I'm not getting in that. That's yucky. All right, I think we gotta go back this way. Look at that thing. That fish is humongous. A paku. A what? Paku. A paku. And look at that thing in the back. That thing looks like a dinosaur. Look at it, even his skin is like wrinkly at the front. I don't know that what is that? Huge catfish. There was an arowana in here. I th oh, I just got wet. Gross. There's the arowana. He's chilling. And this guy's got a solid goatee going on. <laughs> He's not on the glass though. No. What is he doing? <laughs> oh, <laughs> I dipped on you too? I told you was, something was happening right there. What? I don't understand why he's swimming like this though if he's not on the glass. He's kind of like 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 a walrus or something. Oh look, here you go. Now we can see it. I was wondering where you could see them better. Here we go. Wow, there's some pretty ones in here. Yeah. I've never like really looked at freshwater fish in detail other than like the bright colorful ones, but you can get some really pretty freshwater fish. To me these are the nicest ones, particularly. I like this one right here. It's cool. We got another massive reef tank right here. I think this is the one that we were looking at from the top. Yeah. So, oh, look up top, so many fish. I feel like it looked like so many, I mean, it, granted, yes, it is a freaking bunch of fish, but it looked like so much more looking straight down on it. Like now you can kind of see spaces where you would be able to. Maybe they're sleeping. The fish or the people? The fish are sleeping, they're hiding in caves and stuff. Look, he's cool. Oh yeah. Did she say what? This is a surgeon, but did she say what type of fish this? Like which? She was saying that that's the the bright orange scapel that you can see really good on these fish, compared to like the blue hippos and stuff. How they kind of blend in. They have it as well, but you don't really notice it so much. That guy's big. Looks really cool with the light coming through. Sunrise. Yeah. Sunrise. Super cool. Is that what she says? 68,000 gallons? It's a pretty massive tank. And all the corals in there are fake. Lots of fishies. Shark Lagoon time. 
I think we're kind of going to where we're going to sleep. Ooh, here we go. There is a massive sawfish just sitting right here on the top of the tunnel, laying here right now. Not move. Oh, and a shark. Look at this. Look how dope this tunnel. Where? That's, this one's a sawfish? Oh, it looks like a shark tail. Oh yeah, he is a sawfish. Look at this tunnel, this thing is so dope. This is definitely the sickest tunnel I've seen so far. I just love this like going through the super dope. And there's a lot of sharks. I thought there was gonna be like one shark, but no. We're, whoa, what's wrong with him? Oh no, you better stop splashing bro. You're gonna get eaten. You're about to be friggin' shark food. What are you doing? Why is he doing that? I'm not, oh my gosh. Don't on, don't on. Let me tell you, that would be some content right here if this guy just freaking, I don't know. So many sharks. Look at the teeth on this thing. Mr. Turtles chilling in the back there. By far, dopest tunnel we've been to yet. Super cool. And the most fish. The other tunnels I feel like, I feel like the other, there was fish, but there was like one shark. I feel like this is, all right, fine, whatever. Why you always gotta make me look bad? I just suddenly said, oh, push, push. <laughs> get the bait. Oh, look down there. We got a stingray. There's sharks all the way in the distance and everything. But wait, there's more. Here we go, we got a swimmer. So cool. Look at that big thing. Oh, heck yeah, this thing is sick. Wait, this is where we started, isn't it, with this thing? I'm so confused, but I'm, I'm here for it. I remember seeing this. What is this? Oh, that's an emergency stop. They probably have those every, every while. Yo, this tunnel is sick. They do have a lot of sharks in there, I feel like. Look at the colorful corals they got in this tank. We got some green Monty here. We got some red Monty. We got a little bit of grassid right here. He's all encrusted in the big grumpy fish. <laughs> oh my goodness, I didn't even notice he was there. Dude, that's that's really a fish. Yeah. That's crazy. What is that? Is that, the, is that, that, that scorpion thing? The scorpion, looks like it, it looks just like it, right? Yeah. I literally just said earlier that it would blend into the rock and I didn't even notice his big eyes were staring right at me. Lionfish? A bunch of them, yeah. one, two, three, four. Look at the coral coral on that back rock, coming in hot. You're excited, buddy, it's past your bedtime. Dope jellies. These are crazy. So crazy. So crazy. This urchin put rocks on top of his head like a hat. They should really put something decorative in here for him. At least he picked different colors. We're gonna be sleeping under you later, buddy. There's a lot of stingrays in here too. Stingray Bay. Bottom head. Look at the size of that thing. Massive. Oh, he's gonna just go right over him. Doesn't care, no worries. If you guys know the difference between a stingray and a manta ray in terms of shape, like a way to tell them apart, let me know. I'm curious. I feel like I should know by now. I just tried to Google it, but I couldn't figure it out. It is nighttime for the penguins here. They shut off the lights, but just wanted to give you guys a quick little glimpse of cute little sleeping penguins. This one's just over here messing around but everybody else is sleeping look this one's like this one's like dude can you please get away from me so i can go to bed look at these over here oh so cute there's literally like 30 other people on this tour and there is nobody around so this is pretty sick it's like we have the entire aquarium to ourselves highly recommend what are you doing now jason i'm gonna <laughs> we'll be your mattress hey we got a full size because we don't mess around mattress in here. that's right we travel with an air mattress light work. Some of you guys might know this air mattress. We picked this up when we picked up the new van. Is that a fool or is it a twin? Is it a twin? I'm pretty sure there's a fool. Oh man, they got a pump next to us. I feel kind of bad. It's a pumping. <laughs> How cool do you feel? <laughs> this is the best 20 bucks we ever spent in our entire life. Looking at the clownfish, blowing up an air mattress. Hey. Oh, they're on their way. So what's the plan? I don't know, calling you. I told you the plan already like four times. There you go. The 
plan is to go to the end where there's small sections that people will not be right next to us. Jason, you ever uh, carried an air mattress through a tunnel of the aquarium? <laughs> and we got our spot. Wow. Oof, that is a sick looking bed set up. Oh, I would have been so dope if there was a shark right here. Where? Oh, he is coming. Dun -dun 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 -dun. All right, I guess it's time to get in here, huh? Look at this right now. I mean, come on. That was actually perfect timing. Great A content. So dope. Lights out, we'll see you guys in the morning. Good morning. Time to wake up. We are still here, sleeping with the sharks. Oh, here we go. Oh, big one. I'm not gonna lie, it started off warm. Halfway through the night, it started piping cold in here. Somebody started snoring super loud. Literally echoed through the tunnel. <laughs> but uh, yeah, we gotta unpack. It's seven o'clock, we're getting kicked out. We gotta, uh, shall we do that? Shall we do it from here? What are you doing? Ready? Hey. Okay. <laughs> All right, we gotta pick this show up. Woo, feels good to be back in the mountains, even if just for a, are we gonna get a view here? Are we gonna get a view? And no. Even just for a short while, it's been a while since we've gotten to go anywhere except for Florida, so here we might get a view. Here we might get a view. And no. Okay. We have made it back into the car and we are on our drive now back to Asheville. Long story, that's where we ended up having to fly in and just a shit show and a half. But Sips and Sharks was a success. At yeah. least I think. I. Minus the cold and the snoring people, I enjoyed it. I thought it was a really cool experience to at least do once. What do you think? I think it was nice. It was cold in there, and I like cold. For real, for him to be cold, you could only, which is actually surprising because I was cold and like uncomfortable cold, but I wasn't shivering. And for him to be cold when he's always warm, so that means I held my own in there. Yeah, but I had only had a sheet. You had a sheet. All of my sheet and a comforter. What did you think about Sips and Sharks? It was different. <laughs> uh, something I'd never done before. Um, it was nice not having a bunch of little kids running around making a bunch of ruckus. That's true, because we did the 21 and over Sips and Sharks. Jason got my drink chips. Isn't he lucky? Hey, turn up. Um, so, because of that, there was no ki kids there, like little, little rug rats. Also, the we were able to tour the aquarium at night once it was closed with literally nobody else except for the other people that were in this tour. So that walking was walking around with beers. Oh, that I think you could walk around with beers there though. I saw people remember drinks. Oh, these are free beers. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, though I guess those are better. Super cool experience. If you guys get the chance to check out Ripley. Oh, and I forgot to mention the building is located like right in the main. T What's that town? Gatlinburg. Like right in the Gatlinburg town, and the architect of the architect of the build. The architecture of the building is super cool outside. It's like a big glass geometric shape. I don't know if that's a geometric shape or not. Whatever. It's a cool shape. Check it out. I don't know. We are headed to catch our flight home right now. Thank you guys so much for watching. Hit that subscribe button. Turn the notifications on. We got new fish videos every single Friday. Plus, don't forget September 24th in Miami, Florida, the Ultimate Aquatic Expo, Skelly Fest. I'm putting that on. Tickets are only $12 online right now, $50 for the VIP, only 50 VIP tickets. So if that's what you're going for, go get those right now. All right, thanks so much for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed the video, and we'll see you in the next one. Later. Later. There we go.